impressive Halloween display and also raise money for his local food bank. So Kevin Hernandez working a day live in Roseville to see these gorgeous gourds for himself. Hi. <laughs> Yes, so this is a fantastic display. Now we're with Dan the Pumpkin Man, and if you don't know why he calls himself that, just take a look right here. Wow. And this is why. This is an incredible, incredible pumpkin Whoa. display out here. Kind Whoa. of a hidden gem in Roseville. So, okay, Dan, tell us about this display. Why did you get started? Yeah, so I started for my son's first Halloween about uh -huh. 11 years ago, and then it's now bloomed to almost 250 pumpkins. That so. is fantastic, and you said that these are all lit up in the evening, which probably looks absolutely awesome, right? Yes, it's really awesome, especially with some of the different colored pumpkins, yeah. uh, lights, and everything cool. like that. Yeah, I bet. Okay, so let's walk down here because I want to see, what was your very first pumpkin that you ever did? Do you remember? Yeah, so it's actually uh, two of them, uh, this Phineas and Ferb, and oh, Isabella was right here. for when my son was one year old that was one of his favorite John? shows so. and now he's 11 <laughs> exactly <laughs> okay yes. and so you're also doing this too to raise money for the roseville food bank so let's go over here actually now we're going to check out this side in just a second because the display continues but you have this awesome pumpkin suggestion box here so anybody that comes by in the neighborhood they can say you know hey you should do this pumpkin and then i mean um you know do you always do them or do you just kind of pick like which one maybe you haven't done or that's you know the easiest or the hardest yeah <laughs> well we end up getting more than suggestions that I could I ever bet. carve in a, in a month but yeah we take all of those and there's a lot that we never really re were like oh we thought we had that pumpkin yeah so. yeah definitely and then right here this is um, this is your um, Venmo right here yeah. so people can actually come they can scan this and then they can donate um, they can um, Venmo you and then you're gonna donate all the profits back to the food bank right exactly yeah okay. we've donated over $250 last year to wow. the Placer County Food Bank, and then this year we've already raised over uh, $60. So. $60, that's fantastic. You know what, I think you can break the record. Um, this is your first time on Good Day Sacramento, so I think you're gonna break the record. I think, let's try to get to 500, how about that? That's a good goal, right? That's awesome, yes. <laughs> yeah, fantastic. Now again, we have this display over here. So again, it starts over there, and then it goes over here. Now, these ones you said are the more detailed pumpkins, right? Exactly, yeah. We've got a, a few photorealistic ones yeah. that really take a lot of more time to carve and yeah. get yeah. looking good. And, and for those of you watching at home, these are not real pumpkins, so you don't have to worry about them rotting. These are actually um, foam pumpkins. So how long does one take you? So our cutouts take maybe an hour, uh -huh. hour and a half. The Some of the shaded are two to four hours, uh -huh. but then the big photorealistic ones are 10 to 12 hours of carving time. That is fantastic. And again, it's a hidden gem right here in Roseville. So you can come out. Um, Dan, these are lit all night, right? Correct. Yep. Okay. All night, all the way through October. Halloween. Halloween night, yeah. Halloween night at 10 p.m. is when they all turn off and they go away and they go in storage for the year. But again, I mean, this is absolutely incredible. So we're um, we're here on um, where? Greenwood Court. Greenwood Court. Okay, Greenwood Court in Roseville. And trust me, when you pull into the court, you do not miss this display at all. Yeah. And so Dan adds every year to the collection. So I said next year when we come here, we're going to come here the first weekend in October. He's going to have a good day pumpkin, and it's going to oh, be yes. sitting right there. Oh, so yeah, well we're we're really excited about that. I told Dan, I think this is the start of a beautiful connection and relationship with Good Day Sacramento. So again, come on out, Greenwood Court out here in Roseville. Donate to the food bank. Help him help him reach a goal. I just set a goal for you, $500. So help him reach his goal and check out this amazing display. Take some pictures in front of it. It's absolutely fantastic. We'll send it on back to you guys in studio. Thanks, Kevin. And wow. he's got a great suit as well. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dan the Pumpkin. The fantastic work. suit, right? Yes. <laughs> great. Thank you so Fun much. Stuff. Okay, get ready to vote in the or for the downtown Sacramento Calling All Dreamers contest.